The Ministry of Transport MOT will be conducting another investigation into the Baltimore Bridge collapse, in addition to a current probe by the Maritime and Port Authority of Singapore MPA. The Transport Safety Investigation Bureau TSIB, under MOT, will open an independent marine safety investigation under the International Maritime Organization's Casualty Investigation Code. MPA said on Wednesday, March 27. As part of its flag state obligations, MPA will also investigate if any Singapore laws have been broken under the Merchant Shipping Act 1995. Unlike MPA's probe, which seeks to determine if the Singapore flag container ship Dolly and its management company infringe any relevant statutory requirements, SIP's objective is identifying lessons to prevent future marine casualties and incidents. SIP's marine safety investigation does not seek to apportion responsibility or determine the liability for the incident, MPA said. MPA is currently assisting the U.S. Coast Guard in investigating how and why the dolly struck the Francis Scott Key Bridge in Baltimore, Maryland, causing the bridge to collapse. U.S. federal safety investigators on Wednesday recovered the black box from the dolly, which lost power minutes before it slammed into the bridge, sending vehicles and people into the water. U.S. officials said eight construction workers were repairing potholes on the bridge when it collapsed. Two were pulled out of the water alive by rescuers. But the other six are presumed to have perished. MPA said it is deeply saddened by the incident, adding that our thoughts are with the affected families during this very difficult time. The authority said it is working with Dolly's management company, Synergy Marine, to facilitate information exchange to support the U.S. Coast Guard in its investigation. MPA has also requested the Vessels Classification Society. Plus NK, to prepare the technical assessment and stability calculations, which are important parameters to support the U.S. Coast Guard in the planning and subsequent safe execution of the vessel salvage operations. It added, Classification societies are organizations which develop and apply technical standards for the design and construction of ships. They are engaged by flag administrations to carry out inspections on board ships and monitor compliance with technical standards and regulations. MPA, as the Singapore Flag Administration, takes its responsibilities for the safety of vessels registered under its flag very seriously the authority said, adding that it works with eight international classification societies to survey, inspect and ensure Singapore flag vessels comply with all applicable statutory requirements. In addition to conducting flag state and port state inspections, MPA will also continue to ensure the navigational safety of Singapore's ports. It said this would be done by designing channels and waterways in accordance with international guidelines and ensuring that maritime professionals maintain proficiency. In a port state inspection, a country can inspect foreign registered ships in port other than those of the flag state and take action against non-compliant vessels. MP said earlier on Wednesday, the Dolly had passed two foreign port inspections last year in June and September. According to Synergy Marine, all 22 crew members on the Dolly are accounted for. MP said it will continue working with Synergy Marine to ensure that the welfare of the crew is taken care of and that the company cooperates with the relevant local authorities.